Hello YouTube, this is Win5387 here with a how-to video on how to remove and install the RAM in the first generation of MacBooks, and that includes the 2006 all the way up to late 2009 MacBooks. The one I have here is in early 2008. And the tools you will need are a set of screws like I have here, and the specific one you'll need is a size 00 Phillips screwdriver, a coin so you can remove the battery and a couple of hands. So the first step is removing the battery of course and all you have to do is unlock it using this little slot thingy and then the battery pops right out and you can go ahead and remove it and set it aside. And then the next step is as you can see if I zoom in there's a small piece of metal right here that holds, that protects the inside and the RAM is right behind that little piece of metal and you can see there's a couple of screws in there that you have to loosen in order to remove the piece of metal and it wraps around to here as well but there's no screws there so you have to remove screws that are in there And then after you remove those screws that are holding the piece of metal on there, you can just go ahead and pull it out. Maybe not. There we go. Just pull it out like so. And you can go ahead and set that aside. And as you can see, let me zoom in a little more, there's these two little levers right here. And these levers are what makes the RAM sort of pop out of the little slots. So if you pull the levers, if you have the battery facing you, to the left, the RAM should pop out, and then you can go ahead and remove it. Just like that. And set this aside. And then do the same process for the second module. You can go ahead and pull the lever out, and wow, that. And then to put the RAM back into the computer. All you have to do, you take some little bit of lining things up, but all you have to do is put the RAM back into the slot. Make sure that this groove right here is facing the left side. And then you actually have to push the module into the slot and you'll feel it click or something. And if you want to make sure that the RAM doesn't slide out, you just flip the computer over and you'll know that the RAM is secured in the slot. And then you do the same process for the second module. You go ahead, make sure the groove is facing the left side, and then line it up into the slot, and then push it in, and it should click, and then, perfect. And then you want to make sure that the RAM is securely fastened as I said by flipping the computer over and making sure that they don't slide out and then you're going to want to go ahead and put the piece of metal back on that protects the RAM and the hard drives and such just line it up in the little casing there and then tighten the screws back up Okay, so that's tightened to make sure that the piece of metal also lines up with the curves and stuff. And then you can go ahead and put the battery back in, making sure that this piece lines up with these little notches right here. And then push it down, and then lock it in place. So then you've successfully installed your RAM into your MacBook and if you want to make sure you can go ahead and boot it up and make sure that everything is make sure everything's well and there you go so hopefully this video helps users if they want to upgrade the RAM on their 2006 or early 2009 MacBook uh, thank you for watching this. If there's any comments or questions, go ahead and post a comment below. And make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe.
thank you for watching this video and goodbye.